Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I'm Trust and this is a TS Tech Talk video. On today's video, I'm going to show you how to transcribe any video on your device, on your mobile device. So we are going to do this making use of an application and if you have an Android phone, you are good to go. I think this also works on a, an iPhone. I think yes, because you can also see the application on Apple Store. So to start this, um, all you need to do is to go over to the Play Store and then go ahead and search for this particular application. Now, this is actually called a uh, voice recorder by Samsung. So go ahead and select that. So now if you have this particular application, make sure that it's actually um, published by uh, Samsung Electronics Co. Um, LT um, LTC, sorry, LTD, now limited actually. So click on that particular application and have it installed. Now, if you have it installed, let's open and start working. So on default, this is actually where you actually need to look at this top area. I actually have three different menu or three different option. This is actually for standard. This is for interview. And this other one is actually for test to speech. And this is actually the one we are going to be paying um, attention on. It's actually called test to speech. So to use that, click on that. Now, everything I'm going to say right now is going to be converted to speech you can notice this area right here make sure you actually choose the appropriate language that you want to so if you want to choose a different language you can click on this and select the language that you want but I'm actually okay with this now let's get on with it so to start recording or to start transcribing your voice all you need to do is to click on this red button right here the record button this one right here so if you are ready to do that go ahead and click on it now, if I click on it, everything I'm going to be saying is going to be transcribed. So you can notice it being transcribed right here, right? Now, I think I'm actually a bit faster or probably the um, application is quite slow because it's actually transcribing the video, the voice that is coming out from my mouth and you can see it right here being transcribed. So um, we can have this transcribed and Whenever you're done with transcribing the video, you can always stop by clicking on the stop button. And if for some reason you want to pause and stop the transcribing, you can go ahead and hit this pause button to pause transcribing. But then I'm actually okay with this. So let's go ahead and stop this and let's do a little test running and you are going to see more how it works. All right, I have stopped the transcribing and you can now see that it's actually asking us to name our um, our memo. So it's actually called a memo. So I'm going to call this, um, um, okay, my first transcribe. All right, so if you're done, go ahead and hit save. Now, saving this is always going to make sure that you remember it or you actually see it anytime. Now, this is actually where it's saved, right? And you can see other ones I already have below it. But then anyone you notice, guys, if you actually want to know the one that is transcribed, you can notice this area because it have this folder like icon or let's say um, a document kind of icon. And then this other one is not transcribed. There is no document icon here and there is no one here also. So um, what this actually means is that all of this one that has this folder icon means that it has a document in them, a document and an audio. So if you want to play it, all you need to do is to click on play and it's now, going to play I the audio. It, everything I'm going to be saying is going to be transcribed. So you can notice it being transcribed. All right. So I'm going to click on it to actually have it open. So I'm actually, I have already opened it. Now pay attention to the way the transcribed audio work. So if I click play, it's going to be playing. And as well as my transcribed content, you can see it being played and highlighted. So so if any reason I do not need the audio, I only need the transcribed content, I can always copy it out by clicking on it and then um, selecting all and then copying it and then going to my document area on my device. I think um, search for document because I have it here. So um, I can always have this document open, click on new folder and then new document and I can paste this out by clicking and holding and then pasting. So this is actually my 
transcribe content. Now, I can easily edit this um, because obviously if it's transcribing it, it's not going to be exactly as perfect as the way I am saying it. So obviously it's going to have some um, some altered words that I actually need to edit and make it correct. So if after you have done this, you can always come back and save it up. But then apart from that, whenever you are actually sending this audio, if you're sending this audio to, let's say you want to use it to make a video, if you share this audio with anybody, this transcribed content is always going to be there. So they can just open it up and, and then, um, import the transcribed content. But that is actually a case for a different video I'm going to make. So guys, um, quick information before this video round up. You notice the way I am actually saying something and is recording it. How about a video? Because I actually mentioned a video, right? Now, the quick tip is this. If you want to transcribe a video, the video obviously have to be playing from a different device. So if you are playing a, a video from a different device, you actually, um, it's going to be transcribed and it's going to be displaying here. I can test run that, but before I test run it, let me share a quick information. Now, the headache now is, what if you have one phone, you have only this phone and you want to transcribe? You're actually not going to be able to do that. The reason is because um, you can only record one audio on one particular device so right now I am only able to record this audio because I am probably using a different phone so I have different phone so now if I want to transcribe a video I have to play the video on a different device and the video is going to be playing and I'm going to be recording it so I'm going to do that while um, I'm going to test run that for you so that you see how it works perfectly all right, guys, so um, I have a video playing on my left on a different phone. Let me go ahead and increase the volume so that it will start recording. So if you have a video that you already uploaded on YouTube and you do not want to lose the views and you do not want to dig it down to edit it, probably because it just needs to cut some part or blow out some part or maybe add some music uh, to make it lively or um, let's say you want to trim it from the beginning to the end, this video is going to show you just how to do that. Now, um, if you're ready, go ahead and open studio.youtube. All right, guys. So um, this is it. I'm just going to go ahead and stop the recording. Um, so I'm just going to save this as a memo. So that actually was being recorded from the recent video I published on YouTube. So um, if you actually have any question please leave it on the comment section and also about actually how you can do this um on one particular device let's say you have a one device and you want to know how to do it i'm going to make it on a different video and also more information guys um this particular feature is also available on your google pixel um voice recorder and it does this quite easier than the way the samsung actually do it i'm going to explain that on a different video so guys um i hope this video is helpful right um please let me know if you have more questions and i would really appreciate it and also before i round up let me play the video i just recorded from um the previous video let's play it and so that you see how it works Now you notice how the voice was actually low and it was able to pick it. So you can see everything is actually perfect the way it was picking the voice out. But then it's actually not perfect in the sense that some of the word is actually not um, accurate. But then anytime you want, you can always copy this out, take it to a document and then edit it so that you get it to perfection. Then that is all I want to show you on today's video. Stay safe and peace.